What is going on, everybody? Gonna do a little update on the dogs. Otis is 10 days post neuter. So he's got full, full motion. Just let him out this morning. We've had days of rain and now the sun's starting to come out. So now Paxton, or uh, not Paxton, Paxton's my son. <laughs> so now Otis can reestablish, you know, all of his pee marks around the, the property because we do have a fox problem here. I don't know if you can hear in the background, we've got some chickens. So I walk the dogs around the yard. Sometimes they do it on their own. Sometimes they need a little coaxing. Uh, Otis is still on pain meds. So I don't know if you can tell that, but that dog is high. <laughs> Otis, come on. So we're on about an acre. I don't know if you see this. It looks like a path across my yard. It's actually a French drain that I dug years ago to get the water away from our house. Um, and it was open for a long time. And I finally got the drain tile and the gravel in so it's it's nice it's kind of coming to fruition having it completed come on dogs we just walk the the perimeter had to do this with otis on leash for the past 10 days we uh fixed otis and you know i've got a little bit of apprehension about it but it is what it is otis is a great dog but um with Isla being mostly Turkish Boz, we're gonna kind of focus on that bloodline. We're gonna breed her with a pure Boz male. Shout out to Mike Tharp. He's got a gorgeous male. I forget his name, Mikey. I need to come out and see him. But so back to the story of Otis. We had him fixed because he's half Anatolian. His dad is Ranger. Uh, big old Anatolian male um, and his mom is a Boz and I'm drawing a blank on the name of his mom so he's 50 50 and she is 83 17 full bred Boz mom and then her dad was a quarter Boz a quarter Akbash Akbash quarter Kangle and a quarter Anatoly. And then out here in the back of the yard. This is the hen house here. We're expanding this out. So we got foxes that try to come in here. You can see I've got the wire trick. Foxes don't understand that, that that wire goes back. They try to dig at the corner. So that's all you do. got to do to keep the foxes out is kind of that 90 degree angle of the wire on the bottom so they can't dig through it. So that's up next to our vegetable garden. Dogs are just walking around peeing. You can see we get a lot of water here. We're on the lowest part of our neighborhood, so. Uh, downhill is the stream where the property before the, or creek, where the property before the creek. So you can see why I put this drain up. I've got a garden here. Can't have water just holding in it. This little bed here is our melon garden. We're gonna do cantaloupes and such. The puppy found the plastic underneath, so I'm going to have to do a little repair. She's definitely in a chew stage. And man, does she want to play all the time. So there's the yard. Here's the French drain. 
that's going to be a koi pond and that'll be a series of videos too should be great because we've got this big walnut tree that'll shade it half the time i'm going to put a little bit of net over the koi pond in the fall and winter keep the leaves out as best i can so we got the garden chickens pond that's a swarm trap up in the tree got a couple single deeps those are all dead outs from this winter got the hoop house Go over here there's the isla's shanty <laughs> Let's see what's going on with these chickens chickens oh oh you think you own the place do you you can just go wherever you want got a couple chicks there these are our broilers which i need to process Fun, fun. Isla, Isla, come here. So this is the training part of, of dogs. See how she's stimulated? So it's best, oh, and I look, I left the door open. So this is gonna be a madhouse. So I've got Isla by her leash, and now I'm, <laughs> I'm pushing a group of half-grown chicks out towards Otis. She just charged at these guys again, so I just put her down on her side to correct her. I'm gonna push these chickens back in that door. Go that way. There we go. Now all the chickens are secured. I'll put up my little one. Gate here. that with that talk about ghetto so that keeps the cats and the dogs out of the chicken <laughs> that was a broiler saying i need to go in the freezer all right there you have it otis we got isla isla what do you think what do you think isla huh what do you think yeah, you're such a good girl. There's puppy dog. Alright, well, thanks for watching. Sorry about the shaky video. We're about to have a sunny day. Can't wait. Have yourselves a wonderful weekend. I love